Hi, my name's Ann Cunningham, and over a short series of videos, I would like to show you how to use some inexpensive tools and materials to easily create tactile pictures so that young pre-braille readers can have a picture book experience too. To get off the ground, all you'll need is one sheet of craft foam, a ballpoint pen, and a few sheets of braille paper or cardstock. Any paper in the 60 to 100 pound range will do. This technique raises the line on the surface of the paper by drawing on the back side. First, place a piece of paper on your craft foam and then draw. Draw with only enough pressure to gently expand the paper fibers. We will go over it a few, few more times to raise a line until it's easy to feel on the other side. If part of it is too low, just go over it again until you have a nice clean line on the other side. If you aren't happy with the circle that you've drawn, try again. This is a skill and a little practice will quickly show results. Keep your, keep your practice paper handy because you can use it whenever you're adding a new element to the drawing you wanna keep. So you can practice it first before you decide how exactly you wanna draw it. For instance, I found that drawing these little circles for the eye made a much nicer dot than if I just punctured the paper with the pen. When I draw the mouth, I take particular care to make a very distinct beginning and end to the line so that it is very easy to feel where that starts and stops. On a final note, I would like to mention that this face is about two inches in diameter. It's large enough so that you can feel each part of the picture without touching another part. When your finger is touching more than one thing at a time, it can get very confusing. Expand your drawings to include other emotions familiar to your child. 